So I have the uh, Batten 40mm padlock, it's the model 6020. Uh, this is the one with the D3 keyway you see there. I've got the key. So I haven't gutted this lock yet, but from picking it, I can say that I think it has about 10 discs. I can't feel any false gates. It has a gated front spinner at the front and actually rear tensions. And it's got a non-zero disc um, in its second position. So I'm going to have to use a few different techniques to get this lock open. Uh, let's still can't remember if I did this. Oh, zeroed the disc already. Okay, so Sparrow's tool. Front tension on the uh, spinner. And the second disc. There we go. Got that. So we'll start at the back on disc 10, I believe. Okay, nothing on 10, nothing on 9, nothing on 8. Okay, 7 is binding. Okay, seven set. Nice. Nothing on six. Yeah, small click on five. Nothing on four. Nothing on three. Okay, let's go back to the bottom. Yeah, nothing on ten. Nothing on nine. Yeah, a little bit on eight. Seven still set. Nothing on six. Yeah, so another click on five. Now four is binding and small click, that's in a gate. Three. Nothing on three. Let's go back to the beginning again. So ten. Nine is binding. Okay, so big click and some good movement. So I think, so we're all in a gate and I think it's its true gate. So with the gated front spinner, what we need to do is we need to set the uh, the second disc and, and the spinner individually and the spinner is always going to be in the zero position. So I'm just going to tension off disc 10, so the last disc. I'm just going to move that up just so I get the, the two front discs. just want to set disc to if I can feel where its gate is again it's it's difficult because it's obscured by the spinner okay so I think disc 2 is in its gate so I'll lift that up just so I get the spinner and then just bring it around slowly okay so I set the spinner and it opened there we go so it's, it's not the easiest mix of techniques there. Oh, let's get this. Okay. So that one's open. Uh, like I said, not good at this. So it's going to be new to me to see what's in here as well. So there's a Allen screw in here that becomes available when you uh, remove this shackle of screw in it. I think, I think that's out, I'm not sure. Let's... No. Okay, there we go. That's holding the base plate in, so let's remove the base plate. Uh, 
There we go. Okay, let's have a look at these this one by one. So, gated front spinner and uh, it's washer. Oh, this one. Oh, sorry, two. Let's call that two rather. Three. Five, six, seven, and eight. Nine, ten. Oh, did I miscount? Housing uh, ball bearing stuck out. Okay, there we go. Where is a little bit messy? So, yeah, I can't see any false gates. <laughs> 